The Trump campaign has mounted legal challenges to mail-in voting in several states. In our Vote Smart series, we're looking into how your ballot will be processed here in California and how soon. KPI X5's Andre Borba joins us live from Orinda, where Contra Costa County is already rehearsing. Andrea? Yeah, they have tests underway right now to make sure that their voting system is counting things accurately. We wanted to take you through the process step by step after you come here to the post office. You've dropped your ballot in a mailbox. What happens next? Is it safe and secure? Will it count? The first step in Contra Costa County is this mail sorting machine in a secure warehouse. This camera right here snaps a picture of the voter information and signature, also ensuring a ballot for the correct election is being used. The ballots are gathered every day from the post office and 37 drop boxes around the county. Our automated system will take a, the picture of their signature that we just created and they will display it with the signature on the voter's a voter registration record, uh, one over the other, and a human being makes a comparison. That signature comparison and ballot check can happen as soon as the registrar receives it, and 99% of the ballots are approved. Per state law, on October 19th, two weeks before the election, the office can start opening and handling ballots. Right now, Contra Costa County is doing a 30,000 ballot test on their four high speed ballot scanning machines. To make sure that the machines are functioning properly, that every contest was programmed co correctly, and that votes are accumulating to the right candidates. And if you're worried about hackers getting to those machines, don't. None of these machines are connected to anything outside of this room. It's a closed network. Scanning will begin October 27th in Contra Costa County, and results are transferred via thumb drive to upload into the system election day in a room just steps away. We have uh, controls, inventory controls on those thumb drives. Only certain thumb drives can be used, uh, and it's used one time. And then the next time it's another thumb drive. Scott Konopasik, the assistant registrar in Contra Costa County, says your ballot and vote are safe. It's not real sexy security but it's effective security. Andrea, tell us more about signature verification. Is there a particular way people should be signing their ballots to make sure that they're counted? Elizabeth, the registrar of voters says if you can't remember how you signed your voter registration card way back in the day, if it was 20, 30 years ago, mm -hmm. look at your driver's license. That is most likely the signature that they are going to use to verify your ballot. Sign it like you have on your driver's license. All right, good tip. Make sure you sign it the same. All right, Andrea, thank you.